Hello everyone, this is John Woodard, aka Master J Wood, and this is one of many tutorials I'll be doing that'll walk you through the app Strip Designer and how it can be used to letter your comic book project. So let's start by looking over the interface. Once you open the app, click Create New, and the drop down menu will give you a variety of page layouts. If you have drawn your own panels, you'll want the open page one. This will open your page and you'll notice that it says add photo. Tap this area and you'll get some options. If you click photos, you can access your camera roll and select your art. Once you import your art, you'll notice some new options. We'll cover these later. If you click off the page, you have this short menu. Click add and you'll have some options. Balloon will give you a variety of balloon types. Sticker, which is some pre-made graphics, sound effects, or word bubbles. Effect text, which we'll cover in more detail in a later video. And Cell which can be a photo or text. We'll get into how to use this later as well. So if we select balloon and then choose the basic balloon, it'll place it on top of our art. We can then drag it to where we want it. Then we can grab the tail and place it in the direction of our character. We'll get more into balloons later. You can also use these yellow arrows to rotate the bubble. When the balloon is selected, there are some options available such as color of the balloon, the color of the text, as well as the border of the balloon. Then you have the font button. When selected, it gives us a variety of fonts. And in a future video, we'll talk about more features such as installing new fonts. Next is text alignment. We can also change the shape of the balloon. At the top, you'll notice a share button. This will render the balloon, and then you'll notice a new button at the top, which is to export the art. There are a variety of exports. To get the best results, you'll probably want to create a PDF. This is the overall view of the Strip Designer interface. In the next video, we'll go into more detail on each of these features. 